Hello, this is a message for well, anyone that actually wants to watch this video. This video is more for the poor people and anyone that is not rich. Um, and it's more of a suggestion to how to, I guess, topple the 1% as you wish to call them or to put them in their place. More of the problem is a lot of people's perceptions of how to take them down is by using the system against them. The system they made. I'd like to get you to think about it this way. If you're playing a game against the person who actually made the made the game and made the rules for Monopoly. If you played against him, okay, the person who made that game and he was the banker and he ran pretty much everything. How do you believe you could actually win against that the person who actually made the rules and knows superbly how to play the game. How, how do you how do you beat that? You don't play. And if you really want to really take them out, make without harming them, you stop playing the game. You put the pieces down. You get up and you find things to do other than playing a child's game. Because that's what economics is. It's monopoly. Period. You just don't get chance cards and shit like that. You go around and around. Keep going until someone's booted. Financially ruined. And you just keep going. Yet the person on the top, the person who runs the bank, keeps copying money and you have and the money is just purely faith based. You believe you have to play. I'm sorry. You, you don't have to play. And throwing you in jail and all that shit, it's more of a scare tactic than anything. Because if 99% if stop playing, how are you going to actually throw people in jail? They don't have the forces once the once their army is not playing anymore. You are empowering the people who are screwing you by playing their game. Things need to change. And I don't see how a different economic model is actually changing anything. Because there's still going to be people on the top, regardless of what you believe. And they're just going to say that it's not called monopoly anymore. It's called the economic powerhouse, but you still have the same pieces, the same currency, and you still have to play the same game with the same rules. You're, you're doing the same thing all the time. 
and how many times are you going to play the same exact game with a different name till you understand that it's not working, nor will it. Well, that's my spiel on the whole 1% versus the 99% or vice versa. Occupy, I don't think you... I'm, well, I'm hoping that this is more of a focus point after you guys actually unite. Unite under one banner of unity. Because even the 1% are skirting themselves out of the benefits that money is taking away from them. It really is. Well, if anyone's actually watched this whole thing, thank you. And I hope you guys all have a good life. Peace.